Hey guys, Sorker, welcome to Persona 5 2. Persona 5 Strikers. Looks like we're going to be spending a lot of time in Tokyo this year on the channel. First with Yakuza 0 coming on, and now we've got Strikers, which will hopefully make up for the fact that my holiday uh, to Japan last year was cancelled for obvious reasons. I'm hoping to experience the Japanese culture vicariously <laughs> through these games. Uh, we managed to complete Persona 4 Golden in time for this to come out, which is great. I've also finished Persona 5 and Persona 5 Royal, but uh, I only managed to cover the former on my channel, but that's okay. Okay, because Strikers is set to carry on the story from vanilla Persona 5 only. So uh, playing through Royal is not necessary to enjoy this game, which uh, I think is great for those who have yet to complete Royal and we're just looking to find a sequel to the adventures of the Phantom Thieves. Uh, as per usual, I don't really know too much about Strikers. I just know that uh, Joker has ended up back in Tokyo and that the gameplay isn't our typical Persona affair. So we won't be engaging in turn-based battles, I don't think, but something a lot more active. Uh, so I guess we'll find out when we jump into the story. I'm looking forward to continuing and seeing what the Phantom Thieves get up to and how they evolve their story. So Sorry, I'm taking too long. I'm rambling. The game wants me to start. Let's just jump in there. Here we go. New game. As always, you're more than welcome to share tips and tricks in the comments. I only ask that you refrain from posting any spoilers as a courtesy. Persona 5 Strikers allows for you to experience the game with English or Japanese voices. Please select the voice language. We'll go for English. Downloadable content has been found. Brilliant. All right, Joker. I've set the difficulty to hard, so here's hoping we don't struggle too much. Here we go. Already causing trouble. Careful, Joker! We got one coming up! Whoa! Damn. These shadows have really evolved. What a show off. <laughs> Damn. Gotta say, I have missed the flashy moves of Joker. I always knew how to put on a show. <laughs> Alright. Uh oh. Well, this is a familiar sight, except this time, they're all wearing masks. Time to cut them off. Alright, tutorial time, I'm guessing. Wow, that's a lot. Of Let's Jack begin the operation. All right, Mona, what are we doing? That was one hell of an entrance, Joker. They're all riled up. Oh, I can, I can see that. Just keep at it. Go ham until you've drawn every last bit of attention. All right, I'm digging the soundtrack already. Nice to see uh, our level two foes back and at it. All right, let's Everyone learn. Else, as Standard you attack, special attack, evade. Coming, so I'm just gonna run around to while shot. I read the instructions. Gotcha. Whoa. So there's a lot going on in the bottom there. Uh, summon, gun, dodge, lock on. Let's start attacking. Wow. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Alright, so I guess we're going to be button mashing a lot. Because there are a lot of enemies. Time to experiment on some of the things we can do. Man, they wouldn't stop coming. Well, let's try using our gun. Oh, okay. <laughs> Damn. Alright, wasn't too effective. Perform a showtime attack. Looks like these have carried over from Royal, though. At least, uh... We're only doing it by ourselves this time. Show's over. It's showtime. Achievement unlocked. They're still coming! Futaba! I mean, Oracle! Sorry, code names only. Are we still doing that? Is that a rule still? Ah, uh, of course. It was the pre-intro segment. Uh, I gotta say, I did grow a lot closer to the P4 cast rather than the P5 cast, but uh, I miss these guys all the same, and I'm really, really looking forward to playing this game out. Uh, I will be refraining from mentioning any Persona 5 Royal spoilers. I won't restrict it in the comments, but I do ask that you uh, at least mark them for people who may not have played Royal. Looks like uh, trouble in Tokyo has resurfaced. 
I can already see a couple of new characters in this intro screen here. Like that guy and that girl that was just hopping between rooftops. Quite curious to see what's going on, how we're able to make use of our personas again. Considering we fulfilled our contract, we got the world arcana, after all. Ooh, who was that? Oh my, I see. Looks like we've got some new cast members in our party, maybe? I don't know if there's a social aspect to this game, actually. Like I said, I've gone in completely blind. But I do know that this is uh, not as long as the original Persona, I believe. Alright, the Phantomobile. Hey, it's been a while. It's been so long that I forgot the voices I gave these guys. It only feels like that because you always forget to reply to our texts. Wait, really? I mean, I've just got a lot of stuff to do. I suppose it's been a little while for me too, hasn't it? For me as well. I had no money, so I lost service. <laughs> Yusuke is still as poor as ever. Uh, long time no see. It's been a long time since we last saw each other. It's quite late, though. Shouldn't you all be studying for finals? Nah, I'm fine. Unlike Ryuji. Stop, stop. I'm already dead. Anyway, here's what I really wanted to say. Since it's almost summer vacation, why don't we get together? Not a bad idea. Yeah, you guys want to go on a trip? That sounds like fun. Perhaps Kyoto. That would be a nice place for a vacation. No way. Kyoto trips are for high schoolers. Sweet. We should get together somewhere and plan this out. Where at? Well, our headquarters, of course. LeBlanc, right? Where else? Let's meet at the hideout. Although I don't know where the hideout would have shifted to, considering we we bounced around Tokyo for a bit before we finally landed on uh, LeBlanc. Let's just say our usual spot. Roger that, leader. A certain police department. Meeting room. And next on the agenda is the series of incidents involving unusual behavior in public. Unusual behavior in public. Oh dear. We're at this again? Hmm. Bearded man. First, we have the Vice Minister of Finance. What did he do in public? As you're all aware, he had some sort of episode during a diet session Q&A and abruptly confessed to document tampering. Oh my. That sounds like the work of the Phantom Thieves, to be honest. Hmm. Ooh. Soon after that, three Sapporo Central Councilmen confessed to bribery and publicly resigned. Hmm. Well, is this such a bad thing if these guys are admitting corruption? Next, the well-known author Mr. S. Mr. S. Well, I guess uh, X was too cliche. He held a press conference and announced he was retiring from writing, returning his book's awards, and deeming his body of work garbage. Okay, well that doesn't sound illegal. It's, that's quite concerning, actually. Then, a newscaster suddenly got down on one knee, confessed his love for his co-anchor on live TV, proposed to her, and got shot down. Right, well, are those last two really, you know, worth bringing up <laughs> at a government meeting? People do public proposals all the time and get shot down. Other people recant their works and, you know, decide, you know what, actually, I'm not proud of my work that I wrote. Lastly... This better be a juicy one, meeting facilitator. The Director General of Criminal Affairs unexpectedly stripped off his clothing and ran around HQ until successfully detained. Okay, well, I guess if we're looking at them in isolation, sure, but uh, altogether, including this particular one, maybe there is something going wrong in Tokyo. There's something in the water. <laughs> <laughs> something amusing to you, Inspector Hasegawa? I mean, the guy ran around naked until someone could apprehend him. Uh, no. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> <clears throat> Everyone clear your throats. The vast majority of these cases have been interpreted as nothing more than bizarre outbursts. Right. But, time and again, every instance involves a sudden change in personality. Mm hmm Furthermore, none of the individuals involved had any known psychological issues before their incidents. Therefore, we can surmise that these cases are the result of an external influence. Indeed, I guess the Phantom Thieves are nothing but a faint memory now. 
Aren't these just coincidences? Are you really implying someone out there is using mind control? I'll be honest, it's been a hot minute since I finished Vanilla P5 and I can't really remember uh, everyone's take on the Phantom Thieves at the end of it all. The cases I listed are only a small sample of this behavior, which appears to be happening across the entire nation. Hmm. Sounds like the Phantom Thieves to me. Yeah, I thought so. I didn't think that they'd been wiped from everyone's memory. How oh, preposterous. <laughs> what a load of... I want silence! Proceed with the report. I guess it's taboo to mention PT. Thank you, Commissioner Kabaragi. As you've realized, or at least as one of you realized, these cases are very reminiscent of last year's change of heart epidemic. <laughs> the top brass have concluded that this is indeed the work of the Phantom Thieves. Really? Were any calling cards sent? You know, is this our MO? Do we really want to help some guy embarrass himself on live TV by proposing to his girlfriend only to get shot down? <laughs> what? Hmm. Hmm. I need to start remembering these names, Hasegawa. But what evidence is there? No one's even established a pattern. Exactly. And we don't have any sort of motive. So far, doing it for kicks is the only thing that'd explain it. Thank you, Hardy Investigator. I heart you, actually. You will investigate each of these incidents yourselves, as quickly as possible. What I expect from each of you are two things. Really? You're not gonna work as a team? You're gonna <laughs> individually investigate? One, to assemble enough evidence for a successful case. Two, to do so as quickly as humanly possible. Well, she's obviously got some high expectations. The higher-ups are hell-bent on closing this case. I do not know why. It does not matter. All that matters is producing results. Your suspect is the leader of the Phantom Thieves. Well, I had been identified. Show me a thorough investigation of his entire life. Um, uh, okay. <laughs> well, the last year was documented quite extensively in uh, the diary that I passed on to Sojiro at the end of it all. So, the Phantom Thieves rise again. We're back. Looks like it's smack bang in the middle of summer. July. 24th. It's been a while since we rode this to Yonginjaya, huh? It certainly has been. Now for today's train news. Today's headlines are... Confession of document tampering. The diet is in chaos over the Vice Minister of Finance's confession, and the power struggles have flared. Members of the Vice Minister's party have refused to comment across the board while the country awaits his court summons. In business news, fledgling IT company Medice, Medici reported record first quarter profits at a conference earlier today. Medici's earnings have exploded largely in part to their new virtual assistant, which, if stocks are any indication, is gaining fans fast. We're almost there. We are? Man, I didn't realize the Tokyo trains have suddenly gone really silent. Nice to see some... Uh, some students behind me there, the old familiar We've school been uniform. So long. I know it's stupid, but I'm getting kind of nervous. Why are you nervous? It's fine. We're all good friends. We've kept in contact, right? This is going to be awesome. Yeah. When the Phantom Thieves come together, it's never anything less. Exactly. Oh, we finally made it. Oh boy. Is there going to be curry waiting for us? Wow, this place has barely changed. Hey, hey! Ah, oh, young Genjaya. We may have been gone for only half a year, but it sure brings back some memories. Okay, let's get to LeBlanc post haste. I wonder how the Chief's been getting along. Alright, important location icons to progress the story head towards the area with the exclamation mark. By approaching or interacting with the exclamation mark, the story will advance. Well, we remember where LeBlanc is, it's just around the corner, but let's see what else is going on going on around uh, Young and Jaya. We've got uh, Takemi's clinic. So. Hey, that's Takemi's clinic. Maybe we can go see her later. Uh, so. Maybe we can. All right, oh man. I got used to uh, the inverted controls for Persona 4. <laughs> I have to get used to the regular camera movements. Let's go. Come on, you can go shopping anytime. Let's go relax at LeBlanc for a bit. Let's see uh, Sojiro's house. Can we go down the alleyway? Mm -hmm. I guess not. 
Where are you going? LeBlanc should be down the alley back there. <laughs> I know, I know. I lived here for a year. Don't worry. I didn't completely forget. Where's those kids that used to hang out over here? Looks like the, uh, <laughs> the secondhand stores but is uh, closed for now. Anything down here? We've got the uh, bathhouse. So. I can't wait to take a quick bath, but it's only open during the evening, remember? Yep, yep. Should we do our laundry? <sighs> Don't even think about washing me in there. <laughs> <sighs> oh, someone's commenting on the curry. Nice to see that uh, we're still open for business here. Wonder how Soju was getting along since his assistant isn't working there anymore. Mm. Well, here we are. Doesn't look like things have changed much. All right, let's go. Hello? Oh dear. Oh no. Sojiro, you were helpless without me. Ah, the Sayuri. Huh? It's a surprise, isn't it? Surely. Yeah, I can hear it. Hey, you got me, guys. Surprise? Huh. We get you or what? I mean, LeBlanc was always the same thing. <laughs> I'm just kidding. We missed you. It's been a while. Sure Did is. Did you get taller? <laughs> nah, it's like just the fluffy hair. Fine. You're looking fine too, Makoto, you my too, girlfriend. Morgana. Yeah. Morgana's been all right. It's gotten hot. There he is. <laughs> Papa Sakura. <laughs> Boy, were you surprised. Yep, I totally did not see it coming whatsoever until two seconds before it happened. You guys did all that for us? <laughs> Talk about a greeting. <laughs> we hadn't seen you in so long, we knew we had to do something. Good, because I did message you guys to come here and I would have been worried if I was the first to arrive. I figured the best way to get you was to have Boss let us in early. <laughs> Well, you're looking sharp. Thank you. I'm not a delinquent anymore, as you can see. <laughs> Did you get even older? I picked up some attitude back at on home. On second thought, maybe the only thing that grew on you is your mouth. <laughs> uh, I'm sure you all have plenty of catching up to do. But I've got to open up soon. Go ahead and take it upstairs. You've been closed the entire day? Oh, man. After all, it's your room. Have a good time. You didn't turn into another storage space, did you? Thanks for hosting again. No problem. <laughs> you can just pay me back working the counter. Uh, of course. <laughs> Deal. Now, thieves, to the hideout. All right. Let's hope nobody else bugged this restaurant like Futaba did. Otherwise, they'd know straight away. Great. Just when I was enjoying the peace and quiet. Sorry, boss. <laughs> Seriously, though, it's not a joke. Never fails to <laughs> really never changed. Oh, oh, nice to see everyone getting along One day, too. I'm really freaking out. Oh, Ryuji. Come on, we're friends with some of the brightest people. I had so many makeup lectures in a row, I almost wasn't able to come over today. <laughs> <laughs> then I win. I only flunked one final. You two are the same as always. Can't you at least take your classes a bit more seriously? <laughs> well, I suppose Haru and Makoto don't go to school anymore, do they? Because they were third years. Ooh, watch out. Miss President's gonna unleash her fist of justice. Oh, she's gonna scream it out loud as well? Jeez. Will you please forget about that already? <laughs> she's already regretting her ca her catchphrase. So is college life all it's cracked up to be? Yes, it's going well. I've been using the time to take care of the core curriculum. Mm. I've been busy too, but it's also a lot of fun. For example, I've learned how to selectively breed certain vegetables. Oh, really? I do have to say I'm going to be a lot more appreciative of the cast this time around because we're all together from the very beginning, as opposed to, you know, Haru joining really late in the game and so on. So, yeah, it's like we're literally just adding an addendum to Persona 5 and we're going to get to know these guys a lot more. Oh, yielded any results yet? You looking for some free food there, Yusuke? Boy, that got his interest. <laughs> Wait, aren't you in the management program, though? Yes, but students are allowed to take courses beyond their own programs if they feel so inclined. It was actually necessary for me to do that when I went to university. We had to do two general education papers as such. So even though my 
degree was in business, I still had to study psychology and astronomy. <laughs> just to get my degree. I don't know why. I guess it's to broaden our minds, I suppose. Or to just get more money from they us. They even offer agricultural science courses. You can learn all sorts of neat things, like the correlation between soil nutrients and yield. Gah. That'd put me to sleep in a minute flat. <laughs> Come on, there's no, nothing wrong, no harm in showing interest in your friend's hobbies. And you, Fataba? How's school been for you? <laughs> Too easy. Oh, yeah, well, I guess it was thanks to me. At this point, the only hellish parts are the commute and PE. <laughs> so you've been working hard. Uh huh, uh huh. Praise me more. Keep it coming. Ah, uh, well, I've, I've reached my quota for right now. We'll see if I've got any more in the bag later on. Well, how about you then? You're the one we're most curious about. You doing okay back home? I uh, get by. Yeah, fine enough. I should have said I missed you. <laughs> Your personality hasn't changed at all either. Well, same old Joker, same old Sowaku Jr. Well, I've been getting by too, but without you around, it's sort of like stuff is just kind of bleh. Oh, come on. You guys surely can come up with some fun activities on your own. You don't need me for everything. Of course. He's our leader. It's only natural. <laughs> That's right. Damn it. You guys put too much pressure on me. What if I don't deliver now that I've come back? Oh, I'm blushing here. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Once a phantom thief, always a phantom thief. Yep. Just when I thought I was out, you guys have dragged me back in. I'd say we start coming up with summer vacation plans. Anyone have any ideas? Hmm. Oh, right. We should figure that stuff out. Right. I guess you guys were waiting for a leader to come along and deliver some ideas. You're fine to stay here through all of vacation, right? Sure, why not? Well, how about a trip, guys? Come on, we've got a whole month to rage. <laughs> um, aren't you forgetting about your homework? Well, that's why he's dragging you along, Makoto. Probably gonna get your assistance on the road. Blah. Not only do you have homework, but you're third years now. You need to start thinking not just about graduation, but post-graduation. Oh, thinking about the future. It's too exhausting. Can't we just enjoy summer? Yeah, no, stop. Don't bring that up. Not now, please. Can't we just stay young forever? <laughs> Ryuji never changes. Back to the topic at hand. If I may suggest Kyoto, I'll find an abundance of inspiration if we tour each temple and shrine. <laughs> the sheer wealth of beauty I can witness in a whole month. I can hear the treasures of our history calling to me. Oh my gosh, Yusuke, you haven't changed a bit. Just don't take me back to the church and force me to do some, you know, slightly offensive poses, I suppose. Yeah, if it's a month-long art tour, I'm totally gonna pass. trip does sound nice, but what if we all went camping first? Why don't we just do all of it? We can all go hiking and stuff during the day, and even throw together a barbecue at night. I would enjoy a camping trip, though. B -b barbecue Aren't those always b big gatherings for people who socialize IRL? Well, we're kind of a big team, aren't we? <laughs> Sounds fun. You can leave the firewood chopping to me. Hmm, <laughs> really? Well, you do wield the axe. You can summer off right with a barbecue buffet. Sounds badass to me. <laughs> How about you? I wonder if Haru's gonna light the light the barbecue with a grenade launcher. Let's go all out on it. Look for decent marbling in the cuts. That's how you get the real good stuff. Trust me on this. Yep, that is true. It does sound rather all fitting the for the summer. I like the idea. But we'll need an awful lot of vegetables to balance it out. Ugh, oh, vegetables? I mean, that's why I didn't bring it up. <laughs> huh. A barbecue is one of the few things in this world that can pull me away from art. Our history's treasures can wait a bit longer. Exactly. They've been around for thousands of years. What's a couple more weeks? Choosing food over art? You sure your priorities are solid there, Inari? The poor dude doesn't eat normally. <laughs> all right. Our He's all skin and bones. Party has been unanimously decided. We're going camping! And with that settled... What's up? Emma, list recommended camping gear. Emma, is that the virtual assistant? I have compiled a list of items recommended for camping. <laughs> there was a sporting and travel goods store near 705 in Shibuya. Customer reviews rate this as the best relevant store in your area. 
Well, there you go. Ooh, what's that? The virtual assistant, Emma. You haven't heard of it yet? No, I live in a village. Oh, I think I have. It knows, like, basically everything and does all sorts of stuff for you, right? Hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's got this uh, eye that thinks for it, right? Eye? I think you As mean AI. AI. <laughs> yeah. Not an eye. <laughs> I've played Somnium Files to have heard it pronounced like that a lot. Right. It stands for artificial intelligence. It can search all kinds of databases, conduct navigation, manage your schedule, even talk out logic problems and stuff with you. I always thought a pocket AI would be a really great idea. Just something you could like talk to and nurture it and grow it, you know, <laughs> like like your own child. Maybe it's a bit creepy and weird, but I, I always thought, you know, like I've had some fun with AI dungeon and whatnot and just the capabilities of AI in the future. I'm, it makes me nervous yet excited at the same time. The makers go on about how you can ask it anything and you'll get the best possible answer. I remember seeing a demo of one on TV the other day. They were showing off its functions and talking about how it's the next big thing. Yep. Yep, that's it, all right. Pretty solid tech, considering it's roughly a thousand times smarter than Ryuji. Only? That's still zero. No, I'm just kidding. Sorry, Ryuji. Shut up! Just roasted my fellow bro. You sound kind of cool, though. Tell us where all the best ramen shops are. <laughs> yeah, you should all download it. I'm telling you, it's the bee's knees. The bee's knees. I suppose it'd at least be handy if we ran into any trouble while camping. I don't know if it's just me, but some people sound quieter than others, like Yusuke and Ryuji just then, you know, seemed very faint compared to Makoto. I don't know, maybe I'll fiddle with the sound options in a bit. That's a good idea. Why don't you get it too? Uh, why not? I'll let it spy on me. Hello, this is Emma. I am pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you too. You look awfully like an eye. Please provide me your name. You know my name. So Waku. No senior, no junior, just So Waku, the OG. Registered this name? Yes. Alright, Japanese voice off. Difficulty settings, let's go for hard. Yes. Uh, everything else seems okay, I believe. I did look go over these options before I started, so hopefully everything's okay. We'll keep the battle music original. Let's let's listen to that rather than uh, hearkening back to Persona 4 or, or 3, which I haven't played, uh, and so on and so forth. Hard difficulty is for action game veterans who are confident in their abilities and enjoy challenging battles. The difficulty can be changed later and does not affect story content. Change difficulty to hard. Since we can change it later, I have no qualms with putting it on hard. Let's do it. Thank you. You're welcome. Again, I am Emma, your helpful virtual assistant. Thank you for adding that helpful adjective there. I would have been worried if you were a useless one. Looks like you've got it figured out. I sent you all friend requests. Please don't blow them off. I won't blow them off. Displaying recommended camping items. So Emma came up with all that? Wow. Impressive, no? And it's not just random junk for sale either. It takes into account the season, the weather, your personal profile, and even your location for all its recommendations. It's it's very useful, but scary. For real? Damn, that thing's eye is crazy. <laughs> AI, not an eye. Well, should we split up and buy everything Emma's listed for us? Everything? Okay. Well, I don't think I've still got my hundreds of thousands of yen. I might have blown it on a bunch of stuff back home. I won't disclose what I spent Whoa, it on. Oh, it's so hot out. I bet this guy's beat from the traveling too. I'm alright. We just went through all the effort to meet up at the hideout, yeah? So, let's make the most of it. True. I wouldn't mind catching up with you guys. Just chilling here for a bit. Indeed. I have an absolute plethora of discussion topics for us to mull over. Oh. <laughs> Particularly matters such as modern art and the possibilities within it in our current age. Of course. Yeah. Anything but that. <laughs> oh, I forgot how much Yusuke made me laugh. We had a great time catching up together. We've got a new uh, HUD dis uh, display and style. Thank you for treating us all to curry, boss. Uh, nice to hear the uh, Persona 5 soundtrack as well. Like, it's hard, you know, because I was listening to the Persona 4 soundtrack and I mean, I like songs from both and I can't tell which is better, but I do have to say it's nice and comforting to come back to this. <laughs> Don't worry about it. 
Just think of it as sort of a welcome back gift. Oh, you're too kind. Plus, with this guy hanging around again, it'll be nice feeling like old times. Because I'm gonna be doing the dishes, aren't I? Same here. <laughs> Thanks again. We'll be back soon. Well, see you tomorrow. See ya. You know... Should've said it like he does. See ya. <laughs> it was nice talking after so long. Oh, well, you know, you could always call me, but I suppose it doesn't compare to a face-to-face. -face. Okay, let's get to shopping first thing tomorrow. Indeed, we've only got a month. Yeah, we gotta get everything Emma listed up for us, right? Then we should meet up by the Buchiko statue in Shibuya. All right. See you then. Don't go forgetting, okay? How could I? <laughs> and don't go forgetting about helping out behind the counter either. Okay. Yes, yes. All right. <laughs> Summer intern. I was a bit rusty at first, but I helped out around the cafe before returning to my room. Jeez, I can't stay mm. over at Sojiro's place. I still have to sleep in this dingy attic that uh, Akechi happened to mock me for. I'm just some loser living in an attic. <laughs> I'm exhausted from all the excitement today. Let's call it a night and get some sleep. Saving! You can save your current progress when save is displayed at the lower right corner of the screen. Morgana, everything okay? Hey! Hey! Interesting that they've switched, like, examine and whatnot to circle rather than X. The view from here sure brings back memories. Hmm. The sofa? Oh. Looks like it's been kept clean. We'd better remember to thank the chief. Where's my TV and game console? Did he sell it? Damn. My plant. Oh. I'm glad to see that this guy's doing well. Looks like they've been taking good care of it. I'm glad. They're showing kindness to it. Where's my Rize poster? That I didn't know it was Rize until <laughs> you guys tell told me and I met her uh, in Persona 4. My workbench is still there. This is where I dropped my school bag off. My box is missing. Ooh, there's a bike. There's a chair. This is where I did pull-ups. So I remember you training with that. If you're feeling rusty, it might jog your memory. <laughs> Work desk. Mm -hmm. Ooh, are you gonna make some infiltration tools? Where's my laptop? How am I supposed to buy from Tanaka's shady commodities? Heh, <laughs> brings back memories, doesn't it? Do you still remember the tricks I taught you? I think so. I think so. Alright, let's catch some Z's. Oh boy, does this bed bring back memories? You sound very excited to sleep with me, Morgan. <laughs> it's nice to see everyone doing so well. It is, it is. I mean, sure, Ryuji flunked three exams, but he's keeping in good health, right? It's, it's the, let's look for the silver lining. Chief seemed to be the same as ever, too. This place is just as great as I remembered. I'd have to say, it's always good to see that, you know, friends have stuck together. They're still hanging out, even though, you know, Makoto and Haru have gone off to college. So, we're camping in a couple days, huh? Talk about a way to kick off your summer vacation. That's how we do it. Let's visit tons of places. Yeah, that sounds great. Well, we should get some sleep. Oh, good night. Good night. Where's my pajamas? My green pants and black top. I must be beat from all the traveling. I can tell that I'm drifting to sleep right away. Oh, gosh. I guess the velvet room couldn't wait to... Welcome me back too? Am I still in chains? Oh, the damn toilet's still there. Jeez, I couldn't be upgraded to a luxury it's been suite? A while, hasn't it? Or a limousine? Lavenza? You're still Lavenza, right? Yep. Oh no, Igor's not there. Welcome to the Velvet Room. <sighs> she said the line! She said the thing! I think, of course, uh, Igor's absence is dictated by real-world events. Which is a bit unfortunate and sad. <sighs> but, uh, great, actually, that they're respecting his character. I know not whether to rejoice or bemoan this reunion. Regardless, I must perform my duty. Man, everyone else was so much happier to see me. <laughs> What's up? This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Mm -hmm. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. You have a contract for me then? 
The expression you bear now tells me you already know the reason for your summons. Oh? I must warn you of the danger threatening to consume both yourself and the entire world whose heart you strove so greatly to change. Oh dear, it's changing back, is it? A most loathsome prison has manifested. Your appearance is ironclad evidence of this. You have become a prisoner of fate yet again. I mean, I thought I was rehabilitated. Obviously, I'm just a repeat offender. Couldn't find a job. I couldn't stay out of trouble. I have trouble adjusting to society. Uh, what do you mean? Someone, even now, plots to lure you into a disastrous fate. Someone? One person? Confronted by this evil will, your own cries out. Rise against it. My name is Lavenza. I remember. As one who rules over power, my duty is to witness the path you take. I would assume that this is all because of any potential new players who would have jumped on to Strikers because it's on PC. Should the world continue down its own current path, all that awaits you is destruction. Have you the resolve to defy such a fate and face the distortion that yet again threatens your world? Of course, I'm up for anything. I've always looked forward to an exciting summer vacation. You know it. That is the trickster I know so well. As long as I get to show off, you know. <laughs> what awaits you ahead are more of the same. No. Even greater hardships than before. Oh, really? However, you must never forget. I am always by your side. I will never forget. Uh-oh. Fusion alarm. <laughs> the time has come. Nope, that's just my alarm clock. Let us meet again soon. Until then, pleasant dreams. What do you mean, pleasant dreams? I'm literally about to wake up. Oh dear. Here we go again. Alright, the 25th. Good morning. Hey, were you having trouble sleeping last night, so? You were tossing and turning like crazy. Anyway, it's time for us to meet up with Ryuji and buy our share of the camping equipment. Let's head over to the Buchiko statue. Yeah, well, I'm surprised you weren't invited with me, Morgana. Ooh, TV. It's going to be another sunny day for Japan. The temperature's way up there, too. It'll be especially hot in the central city areas, so take caution and watch out for signs of heat stroke. Mm. Looks like it's going to be hot out again today. We better hurry and go before Ryuji melts. <laughs> Sajiro? Yo. The city's heat. The city heat's pretty bad. But forget to drink plenty of water, alright? I will not. Can I have a curry for the road? I didn't. I don't think I had breakfast. It is noon. Damn. Fridge. Uh, if you haven't noticed yet, the store's open. Stop getting in the way, will you? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't realize the store was open. I see nobody here. <laughs> Sayuri, mm. it's a masterpiece. No matter how you look at it, you can really feel a mother's love and strength. Payphone. Shall we call Kawakami? Let's go. Who are you gonna call? Let's get going already. Good grief. Looks like it's empty as always. That makes me kind of worried. Huh? <laughs> hey, why does that cat meow sound so anxious? Everything's fine. Wow, he's starting to catch on to what you're saying, Morgana. Oh, actually, we should probably hit the head before we go out. I think I'm okay right now. Never mind. Let's go. If you pee in your pants, Joker, that's on you. I tried. Futaba, we're going to the Buchigo statue. Are you wanting to come with me? We'll meet them all together? Yeah! Headed to meet up with Ryuji? Good luck with the shopping! I knew I'd be more help doing it all online, so I'm researching campsites now. I'll make sure we pick the best one. Playing in the river and eating barbecue all day, lighting fireworks, telling scary stories all night. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun! I can't wait another second, I'm so excited I'm gonna explode! Hit the deck, so... <laughs> oh, so Futaba's on the map, cool. We can also see our footprints. Uh, doesn't matter which way we go, of course, they both lead to the train station. We've got a supermarket. Can we go inside? Was there something you need to do at the supermarket? Well, hello. Oh, we can buy things right away. I've only got 5,000 yen. I knew it. I am broke. 20 HP, 40 I'll be HP. For you. Look at the size of these things. Is this a supermarket or a warehouse? <laughs> I don't know. The batting cages Let's are here, go. too. Now's not the time to hit baseballs. We have to go meet Ryuji and Shibuya. 
All right, let's go. An 05. All right. Man, there's a lot of people in school uniforms still. I thought it was summer vacay. I guess they're doing summer school like Ryuji was. Whoa, Shibuya is as busy as ever. Look at all the people. Let's get to the Buchiko statue right away. We don't want to leave Ryuji alone with his attention span for too long. All right, let's uh, let's go. I see him on the map. Ryuji! Oh my. Barner's hit. <laughs> that would have been me. Ryuji, there you are. I thought you were Yoshida for a second. What's up? Ready to buy some camp and shit? Yeah, I thought you would have been standing under the tree in the shade, though. Uh, let's hustle to the store so we can finally chill for a bit. It's already way too hot out. I see, I told you. We're in charge of picking up the barbecue, right? Go ahead and lead the way, Ryuji. Go on. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know where it is. Oh, right, we can just ask the app. Of course. Hey, uh, Emma? <laughs> Hello. Do you need something? Yeah, uh, show us that store you told us about. Just point us this in the right direction. The optimal route to your destination. Whoa, look at this sweet map. Whoa. We can even figure out how to help with a big question like that? Oh, this thing's a whole lot more useful than I thought. I wonder how much, uh, uh, uh research they had to do collecting people's questions before they programmed that in. Great! Let's get this over with so we can plan tomorrow's feast. Alright. <laughs> oh my. What's all the racket? Sounds like a pop idol to me. I have a suggested event for you. Oh, really? A promotional store opening is currently underway at the Shibuya 705 storefront with Alice Hiragi. Hiragi? Huh? The hell's a suggested event? Wait, for real? Alice is here? Emma is never wrong. And Alice is... Alice Hiragi is a Japanese fashion model and performing artist. Sorry, I've been living under a rock in my village. She has gained attention with her adorable look and unique sense of style. She is active in a variety of media and genres. Not related to Misuzu Hiragi, is she? She has become a pop culture tastemaker and continues to amass a devoted young fan base. Wow, <laughs> Emma makes her sound huge. Is she really all that popular? <laughs> Can't be if I've never heard of her. <laughs> I don't know what kind of answer is that crowd giving you, huh? Alice really is just over there. Oh, I can't believe it. <laughs> Ryuji's very excited. I'm gonna go see. <laughs> oh, someone sounds interested. You got me. It's rubbing off on me. Your euphoria. It's on our way into the store. Why not check it out? She's totally cute enough for this to be worth it. All right. Well, how old is she first? And remember, I am taken. But there's been no mention nor catch up date. I don't know. Maybe we couldn't make long distance work. Damn it. I mean, she is in college as well. Hmm. We'll have to see. Of course, since I'm playing on PC, the game has no way hey, of knowing hey, what's going on. <laughs> what happened in my save file on my PS4. Heard it's some shop opening ceremony. Wait. Isn't that Alice? Alice Hiragi! Hi, folks! Thanks for coming! A shop that carries one of my very own brands is opening here, today! Wow. Have you ever dreamed that you could be somebody else, even if just for a little while? I've dreamed it and lived it. Well, I know a place where that dream comes to life. A wonderland where you become whatever you want to be. Borderland? <laughs> Alice? And your card on your hair? Now, I've got one question. Does anyone want to visit this wonderland with me? Well, Blair, Blair, Blair. Aww, thanks. Then I have a surprise for you. How come I have a bad feeling about this? I'm giving away 100 invitation cards as a special present. They're magical cards that will make you have an even better time in Wonderland. Enjoy. <laughs> Oh, wow. Lucky you. You didn't even realize she was here, and you've already got a card. Oh, oh my god, thank you so much! <laughs> oh, and one for you! I'm surprised no one's, like, bombarding her. Alice just touched my hand! Hello. Oh, those are some quality specs! 
thank you. <laughs> Sorry, that was weird. I hope you like the star. Sure, I'm I'm sure I will. Thank you. Alice handed me a card. Sorry, Ryuji. <laughs> Alright, follow the white rabbit to Wonderland. Where's the rabbit hole? That's the question. Jeez, what was with that crowd? Man, I can't believe I saw Alice. She was just as cute as I thought she'd be. <laughs> Her outfit's weird. Then again, this is Japan. I just don't get it. Her being different's what makes her so awesome. Right, of course. Well, she's all yours. My heart still belongs to Lady Anne alone. Of course it does. Yeah, yeah, we get it. <laughs> well, are you satisfied now? Let's hurry up with the shopping. Fine, fine. All right. Oh, yeah, you got one of those cards from Alice, right? Yeah, what's up with them? <laughs> yeah, he did. You just got blown off. Oh, God, these two added again. I mean, I already collected all the tarot cards. Can it? There were just a ton of people around is all. And by tarot cards, I mean arcana. <laughs> Not physical cards themselves. The card says Alice Hiragi's Wonderland. Alice Hiragi's Wonderland? This looks like a boring old ad to me. I don't know. What if this is like some sort of calling card? And Wonderland seems like, you know, palaces and whatnot. Hmm? There's some fine print here. Something about Emma. Here's my Emma keyword. Please become my friend. Oh. What's a keyword? Like, to become her friend, we need to enter a specific keyword to even find her? Maybe? Didn't Futaba use something like that yesterday? She said we could become friends through Emma. Mm. Yeah, do it! Come on! All right, if you insist. I guess I could add Alice as a friend. So you input the keyword, then you become friends with Alice? You said it's on the car, right? What was it again? Uh, Wonderland? What's to stop us from just passing this card along and everyone using that same keyword? Unless she's got a unique one that can only be used once, maybe? The keyword, keyword is Wonderland? successfully entered. Beginning navigation. Navigation? Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> as soon as I heard navigation, oh shit. I knew there was something dodgy about Wonderland. Well, well. I don't know. Feels like. Whoa! Yeah. What happened to you guys? We're dressed. Not just me. You changed too. Whoa! For real? Huh? Huh? <sighs> Looks like this place is connected to the metaverse. Whoa. This is a joke, right? Whoa, check it out. Look. Oh Aren't no. Are those the guys we saw at 705? They were also dragged here. Hey everyone! You love me, don't you? Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh yeah? Then you can give me all your desires. <laughs> Shadows! And that's Shadow Ellis. <gasps> <laughs> oh. oh. Whoa. Whoa. What the hell was that? Uh-oh. There's no time. We'll figure it out later. Did they kill him or what? Joker, Skull, let's fight our way out. <laughs> All right. Let's get our battle on. Damn it. Uh, fine. Let's do this. We'll take all of you <laughs> Oh yeah, here we go. Love this remix. Remix, sorry. Stay sharp, you two. We haven't fought in some time. Well. Just warm up a bit for starters. It'll come back to you soon enough. Okay. Let's give it a shot. What did we forget to do last time? We didn't do summon. Oh. Looks like we could use our persona. We should get in there too. Freezes time. Light curse damage to an area of foes. Aha, of course. Uh, let's try it. Ooh, okay, okay. And we didn't use our, like, special attacks. Which is that. Oh, nice. Okay, oh, man. Digging it, I'm digging it. 
but uh, how do we know when encounters are finished? Use your persona. Looks like these guys keep respawning. Do we need to defeat a certain amount of them? Do they stop respawning, or do we need to like fight our way through the streets of Tokyo? Use my persona? Okay. Uh, persona skills. X while holding R1. Persona skills. Hold R1 and move left stick to aim at enemies, then use skills with X. Activating skills will consume HP or SP. We already just did that now. Uh, affinities and weaknesses. Persona skills have certain affinities, while enemies may have weaknesses to specific affinities. By using attacks that an enemy is weak against, you will deal greater damage and deplete the enemy's down gauge. So we still got weak points, I guess, with uh, different affinities. I'm guessing there's going to be resistances as well. Let's go. All right. Okay, Pixie is weak to curse damage. Nice. All right. All out attacks. Circle on down enemies. All out attacks. While an enemy is knocked down, press circle to initiate an all out attack with your enemy with your teammate. Sorry. Since they can deal damage to several enemies at once, it is a good idea to use all out attacks on large groups of enemies. When an enemy's down gauge is fully depleted, it will be knocked down. You can deplete an enemy's down gauge by striking its weakness, or by landing critical and technical hits. Alright, all out attacks. Alright, I see. Okay, so... Zeo... What does that mean? I'm not quite sure, but... I know that these pixies are weak to curse. Done. Status ailments. Most status ailments can be cleansed with items or recovery skills. Some ailments can also have their effects shortened by movement inputs. Shock. Party members inflicted with shock will have their movement speed reduced. This can be cured with Amrita Drop as well as other items and recovery skills. Uh, enemies inflicted with shock will have their movement reduce, uh, movement speed reduced. Physical and nuclear attacks will trigger a technical hit. Close ranged attacks from shocked enemies have a chance of spreading the ailment. Right, so that's all the same. Got our personas, huh? Yep. Here too. Of course, I don't have such an aisle. Just, uh, good old Arsene. Anyone else? Oh, Zaro's fighting with us. Awesome. My HP is actually quite drained. Alright, let's keep an eye on that. Reinforcements! If this keeps up much longer, we'll be done for! Man, there's a lot of them. We make good use of our surroundings. See anything that could give you the advantage? Uh, I don't know. The buildings, I suppose? The street light? Phantom Dash. Circle during on-screen prompt. Phantom Dash. Press circle to move swiftly. After Phantom Dash, you will automatically go into hiding. Uh, triangle while in hiding. Depending on the situation, pressing triangle while in hiding will perform different actions, such as attacking or moving. Uh, if you are in hiding and there are more points to Phantom Dash to, you can switch between different target points with Life Stick. Alright, so let's hide behind the pole. Because that's a good hiding spot. Uh, circle when prompted, hide. Ah, we can hide on top. Right, and then spin. Great show, Joker. Really and that's a physical that attack. Let's go, my head is spinning. Let's go, keep it together. <laughs> now! Alright, we're doing lots of crits. Uh... I don't know if there's, like, a point in time where I shouldn't be using all out attacks. Oh no, I'm clipped with shock. Take this. Oh no, I'm almost dead. Take this. <laughs> Spinning by myself. Well, that didn't work. Uh, weak. Yeah, I don't even know when I took all this damage. Cool. All right, they're performing Zeo on me. That's why. Ugh. Okay. I guess I need to be aware of the long-range attacks of the um, actual personas. Well, we're down to two enemies left. I guess the game was going easy on me because I'm still learning because I'm down to one HP. I'm pretty sure I got hit. Yeah, that's right. I didn't die. For plot-related reasons, I'm sure. Oh god. I don't think I can take this. We're getting surrounded fast. We have to retreat. Okay, where? That way. Guys, 
Over there. That looks like our best bet. We're not going down to mementos, are we? Okay, let's go. Let's move it. Uh. Huh. Take this. Run. This way. Huh. Alright, I'm definitely gonna need to work on my skills. Okay, what in the hell is this place? The metaverse? <sighs> it said beginning navigation. I think this could be Alice's palace. Her palace is the entirety of Shibuya? A palace? I thought those were done for, though. And she invited us in? I mean, we don't even have the meta nav on our phones anymore. Using Emma? I don't know what's going on, but I don't think anything else could explain this. You saw Alice on that screen just like I did. No matter how you look at it, that was her shadow. We just happened to wander into Alice's palace using Emma. And the key word, of course, Wonderland. That would be the most logical explanation. We wouldn't have guessed Wonderland. <laughs> We'd have guessed stuff like, you know, prison, ship, all the all the other keywords we use in the past. Damn it! Whatever it is doesn't change the fact that we're in deep shit. Mm, we need more intel. Let's investigate the area. If this really is a palace, the distortion has to have a core somewhere. We need to find the treasure. And hopefully a safe room. Oh, I'm even getting a faint whiff of it. If we look around, we may be able to learn what's going on, too. All right, well, it's just us three for now. We'll get a better idea of what to do next, depending on what we find. Gotcha. Guess we're doing this. All right. Hey, at least you escaped the summer heat. Ooh, in-game animations, too. <laughs> we're still leaving those trails. Oh, boy. Oh, damn it. You got us good. Oh dear. Jeez, what a great welcome back this is. Oh dear. What is this place? <laughs> hmm. Well... Who are these little guys? Uh, you invited us. Your Majesty, we captured these thieves, but we couldn't seize their desires. We have instead brought them to you. <laughs> couldn't so they tried. seize their desires? Explain yourselves. You look pretty cool. Thank you. So, what's your name? Joker. My name is Let Us Go. Oh. Oh my, she's stepping on me. Joker! Ah, oh, so you're Joker, huh? Yep. Come now, Joker. You need to answer properly when your queen asks a question. Oh no, you ain't my queen. <laughs> Quit it, asshole! Ugh, would you shut your mouth? Or are you looking for punishment too? Well, this is familiar. Us three stuck in a place filled with lust. Wait, it shit. seems. Just try it! <laughs> Ugh, what a bore. I just stopped caring. Get rid of them, however. I don't want toys that don't do as they're told. Uh oh. Bye bye.